welcome back to my channel i'm excited for this video because i'm going to be doing a festival ravey type of um look and um this is because if you're in australia you'd know about the groove in the moon and it's like a music festival that travels um and they came into my town just on the weekend and if you went i unfortunately <laughs> didn't attend but um they had an amazing lineup um some overseas acts as well as local artists and groups as well um one of the bigger ones being hilltop hoods yeah so groove in the move is like presented by panel guard and triple j and they travel performing in different cities um in australia anyways i just <laughs> really wanted to do a look or something that i probably would have worn if i had one. so stay tuned if you want to see me okay so i'm thinking i want to do something vibrant and glittery um something mixed with that and tribal a bit so uh let's get started first of all gotta prime and i'm going to be using the fenty beauty pro filter uh, retouch primer just using that much Honestly, I just focus on my teaser and under my eye. And then I'm going in with the uh, Fenty Beauty Pro Filter, the Soft Matte Longwear Foundation. And my shade is 390. I apply with my foundation brush and I spray a setting spray on the brush and then I just apply. concealer and I'm using Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Medium Tan Sand. Translucent powder. Now I'm gonna do some contouring. I'm using um, BH Cosmetics color palette to contour. There's like a nice um, color that I like to use for my blush. Now I'm gonna bake with the Maybelline Loose Powder, which is the one that I always use. And I don't like to do heavy baking and I don't leave it on for long. I honestly put it on, swipe it away. Oh, and I'm using the NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray. Now I'm just going to go and do the brows off camera, and I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> now let's get started on these eyes. So I'm going to use um, the Zulu Palette by Julius Place. So first I'm going to go in with this orange color here. And that's just going to go right in the crease. Now I'm just going to slowly blend that out upwards towards the brow bone. And after that, we're going to go with the yellow 
and put that on the brow bone and then blend that in with the orange. All right, so that's done and blended out. So what I'm gonna do now is cut the crease and what I'm gonna use is the shape tape. I cut the crease, I'm gonna place this purple from the same palette right on the lid there. this side first just to finish it off and then I'll go and do this one um, but if you can see I didn't fully cover the lid because I'm gonna cut it again um, to put in the line of color okay now the liner area is cut I'm going to line it with a the Jeffree Star the little lip and shade Breakfast at Tiffany's, um, which is eye safe as well, to create the wing liner. Okay, so that's one side done. I'm gonna go and do the other side off camera and I'll be back. A few moments later. Okay, so I'm back. Both eyes are done as you can see. I've just cleaned up underneath with concealer and a little bit of foundation on top. And now the next thing we're gonna do is the little lash line where I'm just gonna take that same purple and run it on the lash line. I'm gonna use the Fortunate Favors the Brave Makeup Revolution palette and I'm gonna go in with this color here to blend out the purple. Take Me Back to Brazil palette by BH Cosmetics. And I'm just gonna take this highlighter here and place that in the inner corners. Now we're gonna put a white eyeliner on the waterline. And the one I have is Soft Coal. It is by Rimmel. Now we're gonna add some glitter. Fun fun. I have this um, Stardust BYS glitter vials and I'm gonna be using this and this glitter. Now to help it like stick on, I'm gonna use the Duo Lash Glue um, in Clear.
some lashes on off camera and I'll be back. All right, so I have my lashes on. They're from Adele, they're the Wispies. And I did put mascara on. I use mascara from Essence. On the top lash is the Volume Hero mascara. And on the bottom lash is the Crazy Volume mascara. Now we're gonna move on to some designs. We're gonna use the white liquid liner from NYX. And we're gonna just do some designs along the brow. I'm just gonna do that nice and simple easy and I also um, I have these I bought this um, for six dollars at Kmart and I'm just gonna put one just in the center here now moving on to our lips I'm using uh, this lip liner well it's an eyeliner but I use it as a lip liner as well it's from Thin Lizzy it's double sided, it's a black and a brown, we're going to use the brown. Now since there's a lot going up here, I just want to keep it a bit neutral down here. So we're going to use this ultra matte lip color from Colourpop in the shade Chilly Chilly. Now I'm going to set my face with the NYX setting spray. And once that's a bit tacky, we're going to go in with our highlighting shade from BH Cosmetics. Factor. Okay, the last thing we're gonna do is put the um, NYX light liquid liner just down the bottom of the lip. Guys, I think this look is complete. Now just throw on some accessories and you're good to go. Okay guys, thank you so much for joining me um, creating this look that I probably would have wanted to groove in if I had gone, but I didn't and hopefully next year I will. Please click the subscribe button and the notification bell to stay updated on everything that I got going on. Alright guys, see you in the next video. Bye!